did change. We did change. Yeah, I remember what you saying. Me and Dawn had a bit of a, a confab the other day, and we got all this for episode one. You know, we're all a bit nervous. And I had me twat of the week all sorted out. <laughs> and then I saw something yesterday that made me actually get up, wake up, because I was on my phone in bed, I'm not even supposed to do it. And I saw that and I thought, I'm having them for twat of the week when we do it. So I said to Dawn before, I said, I'm changing it, I'm changing it. The, I'm not going to say one person. Okay. I want to be a bit broad. Okay. And I'm going to go for the easily offended. Oh, yeah, I hate those people. Right. It, everything's all right. To be, everybody can get offended. Yeah. But where I'm going with it this week, <laughs> right, now, as one of my favourite comedians once said, the absolute genius, Ricky Gervais, just because you're offended does not mean that you're right. <laughs> That's right? very true, right? yeah. No, it was the, I think it's the Edinburgh, is it the Edinburgh Fringe Festival? The yeah. Comedy Festival? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, the joke, the winning joke of, on the Edinburgh Fringe Festival was revealed the other day, and the joke was, along the lines of, I'm paraphrasing here, I can't stop walking around shouting broccoli and cauliflower. I think I've got florets. <laughs> right? How, harm, how harmless is that? Right? It's funny. It's funny. Right. I mean, it, for, it's because it's hard to write a clean joke. Let's yeah. face it. Yeah. it. Isn't it? It really yeah. is hard. And, and I love little one-liners like that. I really do. I really do. It's hard to write clean material. Yeah. It really, really is. No, obviously, it's it's easier, easier for me to sit here and say, because I don't suffer from threats. Not yeah. been diagnosed anyway. Yeah. Um, but a UK charity called Tourette's Action have called for the comedian that made that joke to apologise <sighs> because of the offence that caused people with Tourette's. The fellow that made the joke is called Olaf Falafel. <laughs> that is his name. That's, that is awesome. With a name, like, how can you go out? To, I mean, for God's sake, he's not. It's a, it's a reference. If it had said, yeah, if yeah. it had gone and said, all people with Tourette's are twats, yeah. or made a joke like people, I'm not gonna go there. Sorry, go on. Yeah. <laughs> or he made a joke like, um, no, I get you. What do we want? A cure for Tourette's? When do we want it, twat. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That could be, you know, that could be seen. <laughs> oh, that's a good job. It's like an old one. It's all, it's all but it? gold. Oh, it's all but gold. That, oh, right. Yeah, good I good can't one. claim that one. Yeah. You can. But you there's, a, there's a difference between a joke and being offensive yeah yeah it, I agree you make a joke about something it doesn't mean you agree with it it no. is a joke about it no that's it now if you somebody put in the comments here yeah somebody, this, uh, this is the difference this is this is offensive somebody went in the comments here don't, don't do it or I'll <laughs> fucking hunt you down you put this on the, <laughs> put this in the comments look at Dean fat bastard that's offensive it is offensive well but you just go yeah, yeah. whatever dickhead yeah, yeah. you know what I mean exactly but if you said something like Dean went to KFC the other day and they asked him what size of bucket he wanted and he said, I want the one on the roof. That's a joke. <laughs> or they said, I took a photo of Dean at Christmas, fucking thing still printing out. I laugh <laughs> yeah, at that. Good. I go, hey, yeah. fucking belting that. Yeah, I like that. That's good. But you've... Yeah. The, the outrage. It's oh, the absolutely. outrage that they've come out with. There's so much that they... Oh. Use it for something else yeah. if you're outraged. Exactly. I agree with you. The, agree. the planet's fucked. We've got climate change coming out of our... Jackson. Oh, don't give it. That's another one. Write that down. We're gonna have, yeah, that, we'll well. have that one. Yeah, climate change. We got. Is it real or isn't it? Not is it not real? Who knows? Yeah. UK supposedly developed country. Um, child poverty. We've got loads of it. Yeah. We're now actually not measles free mm. because of the anti-vax movement. Oh, don't give it. Yeah. That's another one. Yeah, write that down. Yeah. No, it's true. It's true. And, and, and we do. You're right. We live in a world where offence is. You know, people get so offended by. Everything. It's just what uh, it, it scares me. It really, really scares me. It does what. what if we pander to these people, yeah. Like I said, if he was being offensive, he was targeting people and being particularly nasty. Then yes, he should apologise. It was a joke. It was where, a joke. where do we go if we aren't outraged about climate change, child poverty, MPs expensive, police shortages? Yeah, yeah. We won't say anything about that other than mumbles on to our mates and all this crap, innit? Yeah, yeah. But somebody makes a joke at a fringe festival about fucking broccoli and yeah. we go bananas. Yeah. If you're going to be offended, if you're going to be outraged, do it about something outrage worthy. Yeah, exactly. Channel your energy. No, I agree with you. Absolutely. It's true. Very true. Make it worthwhile if you're going to do it. But really, it takes a lot. I mean, I don't know about you, but to get offended, I, you know... 
I don't know. Yeah, it is what it is, isn't it? I mean, it, it really, really is. I don't, I don't understand it myself. But yeah, it seems to be a common thing these days. Where everyone's getting offended about virtually everything. Yeah. Um, and what can you do? I don't know what you can do about it. But yeah, there's a, there's a good... Uh, I suppose there's a, there's a big debate to be had there. There's lots of, uh, lots of instances where people uh, have got offended through really the stupidest, the stupidest things. Oh, God, yeah. But yeah, I mean, if if you're one of them dicks that put stuff on the internet like yeah. you're an ugly bastard, or do you know what I mean? Yeah, that's, a measure, that's a they measure. That's a measure you. Trolls, don't that's a measure of you. Yeah. You're a prize one bell end. You know yeah. what I mean? It's not. It's not worth. No. Getting heated up over. They do say, and I suppose this will this will come out with this as well. Is that you know uh, they do say don't don't read the comments. You know whether it's social media or yeah everything else. And I sort of get that. I mean I'll read these comments. I will read these comments because I feel like we've got thick enough skin, haven't we? Oh, well, so yeah, that's about four foot thick. I think. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. So yeah, um, so yeah, we 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 we're, we're big enough to to uh, stand up to it, aren't we? Yeah, but make it funny. Yeah, we're gonna have a go. Make it funny. Give yeah. us a laugh. Yeah, make us laugh. Absolutely, absolutely. But yeah, it's. Uh, well, I think there'll be many more instances of that going forward that we'll be covering. Oh, unfortunately, yeah, unfortunately, yeah. that is the way of the world. Yeah. So there'll be a lot of that as well. So. But uh, but yeah, it's uh, it's interesting stuff. So uh, but yeah, so I think uh, that's our star of the week, uh, which is our human TV and our twat of the week. The easily offended. The easily offended. There you go. So, well, I think we've got just about to the end of our first episode. Yeah. So it's been it's been a bit of a funny one. It's been uh, sort of quite nerve wracking at first. Yeah, just to me, I don't mind admitting to you guys, it was the build up to this. Uh, as has been said at the top of things, it's been a long uh, build up to it. Um, yeah, but I think uh, I think we pulled it off. I don't know if we got stage nerves. There's only two of us here. Yeah, I know. But we've known each other for God knows how many years. So yeah. it shouldn't be. It shouldn't be an issue. But anyway, we had, I've had a really good time anyway. Yeah. Have you? Yeah. yeah. It's been good. Yeah, really, really good. So. Um, so yeah, so the, the sort of uh, the, the sort of thing to uh, remember is uh, don't forget to comment. Um, obviously, uh, please subscribe as well. So you can subscribe below, um, and uh, as we said throughout, you know, please comment any suggestions on uh, stories to cover, uh, anything like that. Do uh, write in the comments below. Um, we've got uh, we've got we've pretty much covered all social media, haven't we? We've got everything. We've got everything, yeah. We believe it believe in an art, we have got the whole thing covered. So we've got Facebook, um, our Facebook page is Doran Dean Talk. Doran and Dean Talk, yeah. yeah. Doran and Dean Talk. Is the actual title or the at tag is Doran Dean Talk. Yeah. No and. No and, yeah, so don't forget that, no and. For some uh, reason social media does not like ampersands, we don't know why. No. But... <laughs> so just uh, no and. And then so Doran Dean Talk and then the Twitter handle is at Doran Dean talk as well. So yeah, so I think all that's left to do is uh, is is say uh, thanks for lis- uh, listening and watching us. Um, and uh, episode two will be be dropping soon, I think. Yeah. So uh, so yeah, so the end of our maiden episode. So uh, so so yeah, been, been great fun. So all that's left to do, I think, is say thank you very much. And we've we've, we've really we've, we've pulled out all the stops, haven't we? Oh mate. In terms of yeah, so. Um, Pyrotechnics. I think Olympics wants us next. Yeah, there is that. So uh, all that's left to do is uh, our fireworks display. Yeah. So are you ready? Ready? Are you ready to be astounded? Three, two.